people, instead of the money going to the bank, it goes to the people that actually staked. It's like, this is actually a really good point because, you know, sometimes when, like when I walk around, like uh, like if I'm going to like a Walmart, for example, I walk around and I look at everyone and man, ev everyone just looks like so like you can see the pain in their face, the sadness, the depression, the stress. 100 You know what I mean? And it's like you feel you feel for these people like your heart because I think to myself, I could never mm -hmm. go just back. Be OK with that. Yeah, I could never be okay with that. I could never be okay with a life of like modern day slavery and just think like you actually have the opportunity to break free from that, but you just need to know how to solve the money problem. But you don't know how to solve that problem unless you're hearing uh, good like information uh, from the right people. But how do you know who to listen to? Because there's so many people that are looking there to scam you or wreck you. That's the disgusting thing about the Furus is they – out of their own greed, they're they're taking away that opportunity from you for you to be financially independent. You know how many people that I heard that listen to uh, to certain people that swayed them away from Hex, and they could have had financial independence and freedom a year and a half earlier if they, like uh, Gunther mentioned, listen to the right people. And that's what I'm proud of is uh, being in crypto since 2017, never shield anything. But when Hex came out, it was like, this is different. This is complete. I don't need to shield future promises or anything like that. It's mm -hmm. all complete uh, before the start. And uh, like Kareem says, it's a it's a win-win situation.